Hello, this is Mike Lively from Northern Kentucky University, and we're back on our House of Cards, and this is part two of building a House of Cards in CS4 Flash. And let's continue with what we were doing. Come along here, we're going to hit our little uh, rotation tool here. There we go. And we can rotate the entire House of Cards by selecting them all with the marquee. There we go. And we're going to spin around here and make sure the other side is right and get everything rotated correctly. There we go. Looks like we're, we're looking pretty good here. So I'm actually getting pretty happy with this. You can see this card right here is going to rotate a little bit out. So I'm going to get off of that, click on that, and I can rotate the X direction there and get that just right. And there you have it. You have my house of cards, but we're not ready to stop yet. We want to come along here and marquee around the entire thing, and we want to turn that into a movie clip. So you can go to Modify and go to Convert Symbol. And when you do, you just call this uh, House 4, for example and hit OK. And what you want to do is give this an instance name and when you do your program can grab it. So what the program does when it grabs this it actually pretty much looks at all the sub objects, all the sub movies and it iterates over those and then adds spins to them and throws them out in all different directions when you hit your click handler. So that's how you draw this in, in uh, CS4. So if you ever tried to draw in CS4 you might look, oh, didn't know what you were doing but it's actually fairly easy as long as you're using these tools to mark you around everything and then rotate and check it, check it all out. So now once you've turned it all into a movie, you can actually move it around and stick it wherever you want to. You can shrink it and expand it just like you do any other Flash movie. And if you don't like something, you can actually go inside and uh, change it. You can also make copies of it. I'll make a few copies of it. And there's another house and you can create a whole village if you wanted to. There we go. Look at that. Houses all over the place. And then you can just blow them up. So uh, thanks for listening. This is Mike Light from Northern Kentucky University. And we'll start another section on how to actually program this.